We now want to turn to our Caroline Forback. And Caroline, in the wake of Israel warning Palestinian civilians to flee the area in Gaza, demonstrations were held nationwide, including right here in Baltimore. That's right, Kelsey. And this one was called a day of action for Palestine. It was actually the second demonstration in support of Palestine that we've seen in Baltimore so far this week. It comes just a few days after the candlelight vigil at the Jewish Community Center. The impact of the Israel-Hamas conflict can be felt from thousands of miles away. Many Marylanders deeply affected by the devastation. Saturday afternoon, dozens gathered at Baltimore's War Memorial, protesting in support of Palestine. We're here to show solidarity with the Palestinian people, the innocent men, women, and children, not just Palestinian Arabs, but also the Jews that have lost their lives. And continuously, if this bombardment goes on, more innocent people are going to lose their lives. So as a person in the Muslim community, just being there for other Muslims is very important. And earlier this week, teams came together to stand in solidarity for Israel at the Jewish Community Center of Greater Baltimore. This is a really difficult time for everyone involved in the conflict, and this is just a great way for all of us to come together and lean on each other. They spent the evening sharing songs, stories, and prayer. We are praying for peace and a resolution that results in the least amount of bloodshed and innocent lives being lost, and that's all we could ever hope for. And we'll have more on the response here at home later tonight. For now, reporting live here in Baltimore, Caroline Forback, WJZ. Kelsey.